It was a joyful moment at the Gateway Center in Ventuk. It was Swabo Party's first media conference after its presidential candidate, Netumbo Nandin Deitua, was declared the winner in the November 27th presidential and National Assembly elections. <laughs> Dr. Nandin Deitwa has reaffirmed her commitment to leading Namibia into a new era of progress and democracy under the Swabo Party's mandate. The president-elect praised Namibians for their resilience and discipline during last month's elections. She did not mince her words when she urged party leaders at all levels to redouble their efforts in service delivery and abiding to the party's election manifesto. Therefore, the Swapo Party-led government, inclusive of ministries, state-owned enterprise, regional councillors, and local authority councillors, will be held accountable for the, non for the implementation of the Swapo Party election manifesto. You know, when the people are going to ask us five years, they will not say this municipality is under who, under who. They will just see everything as a Swapo. And that's why we have really to be firm. With a Swapo party maintaining its position as the largest political party commanding a majority in 121 constituencies, Nandi Indeidwa pledged to uphold the party's ideology and deliver on the commitments outlined in the 2025-2030 election manifesto. Looking ahead to her inauguration on 21 March next year, Nandi Ndeitwa expressed her readiness to take the oath of the office. We must now make all the efforts to make sure that what we promise our people is fulfilled. President-elect also touched on the need to prioritize the protection of vulnerable communities, especially the youth, who make up the majority of Namibia's population. The time is now to address all known grey areas and challenges that we face without fear or favour. We have done a lot, and that's why grey areas. They are grey areas we have to accept. But what we did is a strong foundation while cautioning those with authority who might be tempted to engage in corrupt activities, Nandi Ndeitwa warned that those who might be found in conflict with the law will face the music. She further pledged equitable distribution of economic strength and development to all regions. The party plans to host a victory rally across the country over the weekend. Emil Sebeb, NBC News, Ventuk.